That's fine, we'll just leave. I have a bad feeling. Sorry, I can't take anymore. Worthless, the lot of you. But that's fine, we'll leave. Hmm. I mean, yeah, there's not really much else we can do. Not much else we can do, I'm afraid. Tried to get Iori some extra experience, and we kind of did. That's a little too dangerous. Your cold worsened because you're tired. Cold? When did I get one of those? What's up, dude? So, what do you think? About what? About Fuka Yamagishi, of course. I haven't given up hope that she'll join our team. Dude, her face looks so familiar. She does look kind of weak, but it only makes me want to protect her, you know? Stop being weird. I'm totally gonna white knight her, dude. I'll protect you. I'm so desperate for a girl. He just reeks of desperation. Oh shit, it's the Gourmet King. Perfect timing. I was wondering if you were free today. I haven't decided yet. Mm, I see. I wanted to introduce you to a wonderful menu. Well, if you manage to change your mind, meet me in the usual place. I have to go now. Lunch awake. Maybe after school you should look for him at Polonia Mall. Maybe I shouldn't. If Yuko is free, I'm definitely down to hang out with Yuko. Maybe Chihiro. But that ought to be tomorrow. I'm Edogawa, in charge of integrative integrative learning. <laughs> in this class, I'll ease all your worries. It's psychotherapy through magic. Alright, everyone, be very, very quiet. No talking. Silence. Were you surprised to hear me bring up magic? It's a recent proposal, so it's not well known yet. Here it is. Those who believe will be saved. Study hard, and I can beat your weak minds into shape. <laughs> Now then, let's get on with our first lecture on the basics of magic. Who can use magic and who cannot? That'll be our starting point. Some of you might think magic lets you do absolutely anything. Excuse me. Pulling pranks on people, hurting your enemies. If that's what you think, then you'll never learn magic. It's true of both Eastern and Western sorcery. Those with wicked hearts will either be powerless or be driven to ruin. There's one more thing that can't be forgotten when learning magic. There is a master. You should aspire to become a good, as good as your pre predecessors, especially if you're studying difficult magic. If you don't have a master, learning the black arts will be impossible. When you begin your training, you'll have to live in two worlds at once, the real world and the dark realm. If you can't distinguish between the two, you're headed for certain disaster. That's why the presence of a master is of the utmost importance. With that in mind, I'll move on to meditation, a standard practice in magical training. I've got some handouts for you. You feel tired. Close your eyes for a few minutes. Now then, it looks like it's time. If you're interested in the subject, try meditating before going to bed. Slowly recall the events of the day. It's like traveling back through time. If you can do that flawlessly, you may just make a good magician. <laughs> That's all for today. Like, why in the hell would they let this dude teach? He's a whack job. Come now, it's magic, and it's real. Listen, man, if magic was real, I'd be the first to know about it. I saw your test results, Nodio-kun. Not bad. I'm sure Mitsuda-senpai will be relieved. Why do you care about my test results, huh? Can we talk here, Chihiro? Hi. Hello. I was able to say hi to you. I've been telling myself not to be afraid, but the more I think about it, the more scared I get. I hope somehow I can get better at this. Good luck. Yeah, thanks. I'm sure asking around would like freak her the fuck out. He'd be like, oh my god. That's such a huge step. I'll do my best. Um, hmm. Well, Yuko's not av available today.
What to do? Um, I guess we could go start Bay Bay. Should be downstairs. Bay Bay's kids. This is the only economics room. There's a note on the door. Considering your academic ability, you are easily able to translate it. it. Says you never came. Sorry, I'm gone now. Oh my god. Baby's just gone forever. I mean, I guess I could go to the old couple since they apparently can lead to Bebe. Bebe's kids. Parents are gonna get a divorce. This, oh, yeah, this is the right place. You want to spend your time with the old couple? Sure. I know eventually baby like comes in here or something. Oh, you came back. Welcome. Uh, what was your name again? I'm just joking. I know who you are. I'm not that old. My wife and I were just talking about you, Norio Chan. Norio Chan, do you like melon breads? Someone gave them to me, but I have more than enough. Go ahead and take one. Thanks. Don't worry about it, it's just a melon bread, there's no need to thank me. Norio Chan, you're so polite, I wish he had been that way. Bukichi seems impressed. Do you want one for a friend too? Because it'll take us forever to finish them all. Alright, here you go. Um, uh, what was your name again? <sighs> Remember, dear, this is Norio Chan. I'm sorry, Norio Chan. He's terribly forgetful lately. Here you go. Tainted melon bread. Where did he run off to, dear? He should be here helping customers. I'm sorry, Norio Chan. Who's he? Our spoiled son. He hasn't been back in a while. Bunkichi seems lonely. Where did he go, dear? Must you, dear? Mitsuko seems sad. What are you talking about? Oh, that's right. Our son is deceased. My apologies, Norio Chan. I hope I'm not making you feel uncomfortable. Bunkichi and Mitsuko shared their painful past with you. Your relationship is stronger now. Jeez, oldsters. I'm sorry that that happened to you. Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the hero font Arcana. The old couple's social link has reached level 2. Your power to create personas of the hero font's arcana has grown. Interesting. It's getting dark out. Hey, hey, why the gloomy faces? It's dark outside. I don't need it to be dark in here, too. Please come again. We'll be waiting for you, Norio-chan. After saying goodbye to Bunkichi and Mitsuko, you decide to go back to the dorm. Welcome back. Hmm, that's strange. The number of victims seems to be on the rise again. Apparently the decline... <coughs> Excuse me. Apparently the decline was only temporary. Huh, does that mean no matter how many shadows we defeat, more will just keep coming? If that's the case, then what's the point of fighting? If we do nothing, then everyone will eventually join the lost. Our efforts have prevented the crisis from escalating. I guess you're right. You know, it's kind of creepy when you think about it. If we couldn't use our personas, then the whole city would be crawling with zombies. Man, it's too bad that Kirijo group had to summon a gateway to hell. Like, I know the basics of this game's story. Like, I'm not completely blind. But, like, there are finer details that I don't know. 
drink some of that delicious pheromone coffee whoa I like how like nobody cares it's like there's just some dude out there with their mouth hanging open in the rain like, well you can't really help these people just you know smooth sweet I think that's level four, so now I'm able to talk to him. What's his face? There's a. I have to unlock it. Let me open up my little guide that I wrote for myself here. Let me move this a little this way. So, yeah, old couple, baby. So I need to talk to Ma like I need to do Maya's stuff. <laughs> to get to um Tanaka. I mean, like I said, I'm probably gonna focus like on one thing. You don't seem to be feeling well. Like I'd like to get my academics up, but at the same time it's like eh. Realistically, would have to do multiple playthroughs to get our stats max, and then at that point, we can just do nothing but social link stuff and Tartarus stuff. You overhear a conversation. I heard from a younger guy in my club yesterday that the 10th graders are teasing someone. What, like bullying him? Poor kid, what's his name? I don't know. All I heard is that it's really a problem. I thought our school was peaceful too, but I guess it's not so much. The first bell has rung. Fools! Never underestimate people's ability to be shitty towards one another. Boy, I tell you what. Quiet down, class. It's time to begin today's lecture. Progredio ad rukem shiderem. Uh, Mr. Okoda left work early today, so today's lecture will be a little different. You look fine, but he claimed you didn't feel well. Make sure you know what you're eating, everyone. And make sure you know what you're eating, everyone, before you take a bite. Last time I related some basic magical knowledge. Today I'll add to, to I'll add to that with a discussion of meditation. <sighs> but let's review the ways that magicians meditate. Tighten your creative impulse, the source of all magical power. Carefully observe a real-world object and recreate it in your head the last detail. That's the western style. But I'd also like to talk about the eastern style of meditation. Meditation was actually refined in the east. Modern magicians adapted eastern meditation for their original style. Straighten yourself, take a deep breath, and concentrate. Those are the basics of eastern meditation. You don't need much to meditate. All that's required is a quiet environment and some time. It doesn't take long, but you should allot at least 15 minutes for it. Now for the practicalities. First, your posture. Choose a position you're comfortable in. Sitting cross-legged is easy for most. Or you could try the full lotus position called Kekahuza. You can also meditate while sitting on a chair. Any position will work as long as you're relaxed. Once you can breathe comfortably, cover or close your eyes and relax. Now that you've prepared yourself physically, let's focus on your mind and soul. Imagine a symbol, perhaps a large tree or the moon. If you wish... It could even be the god of your own faith. However, do not empty your mind. That would actually be foolhardy. You run the risk of losing control of yourself. Man, this dude blathers on for like so freaking long. So what have we learned? To practice meditation is to imagine some sort of symbol. The Christian practice of prayer, for instance, is a heightened form of meditation. Uh, speaking of sitting comfortably. The imagined symbol is there for other reasons besides helping the meditation go smoothly, however. It can be very dangerous to plumb the depths of your consciousness. By keeping a clear symbol in mind, you can avoid plunging over the edge. Go ahead and try meditating if you'd like. That's all for today. You stayed up and listened to the lecture. Your academics has increased. Well, I'll be... You come into the fucking meeting tonight? What a coincidence, Norio-kun. I was looking for you. Have you found any new leads? Mm, not really. I see. This may be a tough one. Well, if you hear anything, let me know. I'll see you later. So, 
I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone. And she freaked out and started crying. <laughs> like it was the end of the world. You should have seen the look on her face. It was priceless. Oh my god. I can't I believe that. In all my life. <laughs> Batches. They're making fun of someone. Don't they have anything better to do? Losers. Huh? Where's that voice coming from? What voice? I don't hear anything. Oh my god, stay away. What's wrong, Maki? Maki? Uh, are you okay? Sorry. What were we talking about? I can't stand girls like that. What a batch. Thank you for the raid, Moogle. Hope you had a good stream. Class has ended for today. Well, let's see if we can't start that, uh... That thingy. PA room. Hmm. Since you have Fornius, a persona of the Emperor Arcana, you should get along well with Hidetoshi. Would you like to spend some time? Sure. I'm only doing this for Chihiro, though. Don't get any strange ideas about me wanting to be a student council president. Get Kokan High School student council room. The staff members are arguing. How many times do I have to explain? It's like I'm talking to a moron. Why are you accusing me? The cigarette butt was in the boys' bathroom, right? Can you prove that it wasn't a girl who left it in there? Damn, Lost Ark has some classic JRPG vibe. There's just no reasoning with you. No one seems to agree with Hidetoshi. Everyone has left. What a bunch of Neanderthals. Norio-kun, were you there the whole time? They can be pretty cruel. Don't hold it against them. They're like children. They just don't understand. Hidetoshi seems satisfied. Sooner or later, they'll see the light. Then they'll respect me. I'm not isolating myself, I'm just being aloof. Sooner or later, someone always gets hurt in any relationship. I guess I'm preaching to the choir, though. I apologize. It seems like Hidetoshi's trying to be a good friend. Do you understand Hidetoshi better now? Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the Emperor Arcana. So what about it is like a classic JRPG. From what I know, it's like Diablo. Your power to create, when you get level 40, you get access to its open world version. Your power to create personas of the Emperor Arcana has grown. It's getting dark out. There's no reason to have a meeting if no one's here. Let's go. We decide to go back to the dorm. Like, what am I supposed to do to be able to talk to Chihiro? So you're saying that it has open world elements, and that's what makes it feel like a classic JRPG to you? Interesting. Remember the Tales of the Abyss when you ride a ship? You mean like, fly the ship around, or like, sail around, or what do you mean by that one? So you can fly in Lost Ark, or... Is that what you're getting at? Sail, okay, so... When you hit level 40, you just get the ability to move freely between the different continents, is what you're saying. That's what I'm hearing. Hopefully we can fly in the game someday. Interesting. Uh, pheromone coffee or what? I mean, I'm going with charm this time around. Nick Dameron, he really thought. Colonial Mall is a golf cafe. You enjoy a cup of pheromone coffee. You feel people looking at you.
what will you do? Excuse me. Your condition improved because you rested. You overhear a conversation. Hey, did you hear that? That 11th grader. Oh yeah, the one who was lying on the ground this morning, right? I hope she just ran away from home. But I feel like this is the start of something big. Yeah, there might be reporters and camera crews and stuff. <sighs> I don't want to deal with it. First bell has rung. The one that was hearing voices and shit? Yeah, I guess. If only they would move all the students out of this school that's haunted by ghosts and demons. Oh, I think she's tr like lost in Tartarus, right? That's where we go and find her. Everyone's talking about a rumor. Man, can you believe these people? So, did you hear the details? Uh, uh. -uh. Well, a girl from 2E went missing last night. This morning, they found her lying on the ground in front of the school gate. Nobody knows what happened, and supposedly she's still unconscious. Oh yeah, that's interesting. Yo, Yucatan. This is a tough case, even for Junpei Iori, Ace Detective. Nobody cares, Junpei. Ace Detective? Are you stupid or something? More like stupid, Ace Defective. Whoa! Hey, I resent that. Sick burn. Where have you been? Me? I I've been sitting at my desk. Teacher. That girl they found. I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. She seemed okay then. Whoa. Now that's really strange. 